Angelo here. Welcome to my channel, and welcome back to my stream. I've just been going through the old catalog, uh, but I noticed that some people still need a little bit of tutorial. In Dead Frontier 2, we don't have a tutorial system out yet, so I just figure I found some of these old clips that I was trying to help out any kind of newer players or whatnot. So now that I know that I pretty much have a little bit of a tutorial here, and I can try and help some people out, here you guys go. These are my breakdown of the actual prices whenever there is not an event going, and also just the overall prices that you should always look for. And anything higher than that, just know you might just want to do some loot. So yes, this is video is quite old. <laughs> just like just digging. Is that Batman? Dumpster diving? The fella's gotta eat. Digging in the old archives, so I figure I'd get them up now. So thank you much, guys. Uh, enjoy, and here is my old clip talking about ammo prices. Enjoy. I'll show you right now. Pricing-wise, if you're buying ammo, 100 or less for 32 ACP. Anything under 100, buy that shit. That's a good deal. When it comes to uh, 9 millimeter, anything, I mean, that's, fuck yeah. Anything under 250. 250 and under, it's on like Ray Poupon. Get that shit. You know what I'm saying? Uh, 357, typically anything around like under 140 or 150. You can grab that. So like 120, that that's great. You know, that's amazing. 38 special, I mean, that's a great price. 160, normally the shit's about like 180, like 280. But uh, I guess people are just looting it and they're not they're not understanding how much that shit actually cost. 556er, um, I would say anything under, uh, usually under about 130, 120. That's the average. 7.62, shit, I mean, anything under like, like 400. That's usually the price, but like 375, that's pretty good. If you're lucky enough, 350 is a good price, but I usually just loot this, I don't buy this. 7.62, it just costs too much. Um, 20 gauge, I want to say, yeah, about, well, it's supposed to be like maybe like 120, but it looks like 150 is average right now. And then 12, 12 gauge, I mean, honestly, 245, that's great. I used to, I made a lot of my money by selling 12 gauge, and when I was selling it back then, it was selling for like 400. 400 350 but obviously the chinese um players have definitely helped the market and you know those guys they they loot all day so they've definitely brought the prices down so you got to thank them thank the chinese players they're they're hooking you up so that's my light breakdown on pricing when it comes to ammo prices and there you go guys uh that was my quick little old breakdown man my mic quality was ugh, bad but anyway, guys, uh, thank you very much for uh, tuning in. Hopefully this guide helps you. If you ever want to know what I... I've only been playing for roughly about a little over a year. Um, yeah, about a year. And a year now. So this is what my thoughts, and this is exactly how I choose to buy ammo. Again, I don't buy 7.62, and I don't buy 12 gauge. I try not to buy 12 gauge. But there you go, guys. Stick to that. You'll have the great, um, you'll have a lot more savings. Don't forget to loot. If you have another alt, make one use a certain ammo and use another one that uses a certain other kind of ammo. And then just keep swapping back and forth. Alright guys, good luck out there. And hopefully this guide helped you out. Uh, let, me, let me know in the comments below. And if not, I'll see you guys out there. Later.